हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज चरण लेट्स कंटिन्यू द जावास्क्रिप्ट फ्रंट एंड वेब ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज नाउ इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल आई विल एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू शो एंड हाइड द सेलेक्टेड चेकबॉक्स टेबल रोस विथ अ बटन कंट्रोल फॉर दैट आई एम यूजिंग अ सिंपल जावास्क्रिप्ट एंड सम स्टाइल्स वी आर यूजिंग सीएसएस स्टाइल्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द ट्यूटोरियल and here we got the final output of our application notice how to show hide the selected checkbox rows in a table suppose if i select lalita and peter i want to hide this row notice we have the rows are hidden the selected checkbox rows are hidden show all rows again we got the hidden rows now this time i'm selecting charan peter um hide rows see the selected rows are highlighted again show all rows if i select all the rows hide rows it selected all the selected rows are hidden show all rows we got for this video tutorial i'm using visual studio code first let's open our folder which is a javascript python tutorials and here it is our folder is added to the vs explorer let me expand this folder now inside this folder i will add one um file name called show hide um rows rows dot tab uh, htm and here we got the newly created html file is open let me minimize this explorer as well as the welcome page i'm closing now let's write the coding part first i am adding a simple doc dot html the basic html elements i'm adding as usual here header section after the header section i'm adding the body tag After the body tag, I'm adding one center element. Inside the center element, I'm adding one H1 tag. How to show? How to show and hide the selected selected checkbox um, rows in a table in a table. i'm adding one horizontal and how to show hide the selected checkbox rows in a table after that i'm adding one horizontal line now i'm adding one button control button which is a first hide rows i'm adding hide rows second button call uh, show uh, show all show all show all rows let's add show all rows and i'm adding functionality on click i'm adding the function name here this function will write uh, very soon in the header section i require the show all click event also the button click event which is a show all rows show all rows then i'm adding one more horizontal line here i'm adding one table called id my table my table id uh, id i'm adding for the table dr table headers let's add i'm adding select select table headers name name let's add the age table header age and some city let's add the city after the table row next we require the table data select and the select the first column select i'm adding a checkbox control so here i'm adding one input type is equals to checkbox and the class the class also mm, i'm adding the checkbox checkbox value is equals to 1 and this is very important the value will be changed to every checkbox control mm, next td charan next one is the name age and city td age is 28 small td 28 and city is hyderabad hyderabad let's copy this one copy this one uh, tr the whole tr you need to copy this okay so Four and five. Just for the demo purpose, I'm adding five here. One. This is a two, 
and um, Lalita, this is 25 and this is the Lucknow the value I'm changing values are important here because we are select the checkbox based on the value only two three Rajesh 32 let's add the delay Peter 38 Mumbai this one is uh, uh, Rani let's have to, to two this one is um, Bangalore that's not the Bangalore that's it we have done the designing part we got one table and two button controls now we require the JavaScript functionality in the header section I'm adding the script tag script function function hide rows first I'm hiding the rows which are the selected checkbox uh, checkboxes hide rows variable define one variable here checkboxes is equals to document that get element by class name here the class names we have added the checkbox we will select so class name class name checkbox and for variable for variable i is equals to zero i is less than checkboxes dot length we require the length and i plus plus then define one variable another checkbox uh, checkboxes because we have more than one checkbox so it's an array variable value the checkbox selected value here i'm getting checkbox dot value then that selected row i want to hide so document dot get element by id of the table copy this one table id i have to um, place here rows rows value again if if checkbox dot check checkbox dot check row dot class list dot add hidden 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 else part else now in the else part i want to remove the hidden functionality copy this one instead of add uh, i'm removing remove method hidden that's it we have done the javascript functionality now uh, we require the function show all also we require function show all rows this is a function show all rows variable rows i want to show all rows no document dot get element by id all rows from my table which is the table id dot rows property for variable i is equals to zero i is less than rows dot rows dot um, length i want the length i plus plus i plus plus rows array dot class list dot remove hidden remove hidden that's it we have done the javascript functionality show all rows and hide rows this is now let's add some styles in the above script i'm adding style the first the first style i'm adding hidden dot hidden the class name hidden is display none display none then i'm adding for the table border is one pixel solid and i'm adding uh, red let's add the red color and text align 
external and center external and center font size is large i'm adding tr table rows and table data also border uh, border one pixel solid solid black color let's have the black color table headers i'm adding the table headers uh, background color is uh, black background color of the table header black and color is white color is white and uh, font size i'm adding large table headers text align text align is center center you don't require this thing and now the what we left here button controls let's add the button controls um, button element button element and instead of finding the same thing let's copy this one and paste here button also black color and the text color of the button is white and let's add some groovy also border um, border top border top groovy groovy white some some designing will add we'll check how it looks border bottom groovy white the text color is white so what we'll do is we'll add red color that's it we have done the complete coding part uh, let's save this file first save we'll check the final output of our application further open file explorer the folder i have created in the e drive uh, which is a javascript fm tutorials and the file name in this folder and the file name is a uh, is a, what is the file name show and hide no show and hide rows this is a file name and here we got the final output of our application notice how to show hide the selected checkbox rows in a table suppose if i select lalita and peter i want to hide this role notice they have the rows are hided the selected checkbox rows are hided show all rows again we got the hide rows now this time i'm selecting charan peter um, hide rows see the selected rows are highlighted again show all rows if i select all the rows hide rows it's selected all the selected rows are hided show all rows we got now i'm hiding the charan and lalita only see that's it in this video tutorial i have explained how to hide and show the selected checkbox rows in a table using a javascript thanks for watching this video tutorial please subscribe share and leave your valuable comment we'll catch you in my next video tutorial